This is Ben from Life in 360, and in this video, I'm going to show you the Veer app, which has just been released for iPhone and Android. And this app is going to allow you to edit 360 videos on the fly on your mobile in minutes. So there are now three major 360 video editing apps available. One of them is Veer, one's Collect, and one's V360. They're all great, and this one is going to be a really good option if you want specific things. So I'm gonna go ahead and open it up, and this, by the way, is a free app. So go ahead into the App Store or Google Play and download it, because it's awesome. So straight away, we're going to hit New Project. Here we have our camera roll. It automatically detects our videos, and it only lets you import the Equirectangular 2x1 360 videos. So I'm going to choose three. I'm going to start with, let's say, this one. And as you can see down the bottom left, that is first in our queue. Then the second one will be, let's say, this one. And third one, let's try this one here. Now go next, and straight away, we have the view of our very first clip. There I am, what a handsome looking guy. And there you go, I can move around and watch back that clip. First, what we wanna do is trim each clip. So you do that by pressing down on each individual clip, and you press the trim button there. Here, we can then trim the top and tail. So you just drag your thumb across. So that looks good. And let's keep it short, maybe nine seconds. Done. All right, so we can also reposition this. Um, if we want to start this video on my face, what we do is we press orientation there. And currently it's there, but we can drag it across. So now when viewers play the clip for the first time, it's going to start smack bang on my beautiful mug. And there we go, we press play and there it goes. Now we do that to all of our other clips in the timeline. So I'm going to go to this second one here I'm going to hit trim and trim the top and tail. So I want to take off the first eight seconds and maybe the end, let's say 10 or so. Just that middle section, that looks good. Done. So we've got an 11 second clip now. Finally, our third one, we'll go trim and let's start right in the middle. This is me and Michael from 360 Rumors. Very nice guy and we hit done. All right, so we've done our trimming. Next, we wanna go and make finer adjustments. So, Veer is cool because you can add titles, you can also add little stickers and cool stuff and music. So I'm gonna show you how to do that, it's very simple. So, go to our first clip, and down the bottom panel there, you've got that T, that's for text. Where are my friends? There we go, and you can then change the color to whatever you like. I'm gonna go black. And you can also change the scale and orientation. Make it a bit big. And I'll place it above my head. And what's cool about this is when you move it around the sphere, you can see it then moves within the 360 space. That looks really awesome. So it's going to look natural when you do pan up um, and you look at the title, it's not going to be all skewed. So excellent. Finally, we hit set time. And this, is, this dictates essentially how long this title is going to last. So I'm going to go down, just want it to last the first clip. And on that timeline there, you can see those white dots. Those represent our clips. So I'll hit done because I only want that to be on my first clip. All right, next. I'm going to go back to our timeline there. Click the next one. Click on the next clip. And again, I'm going to add a title. Here's one. All right. Adjust our length. Just want it to be this one clip. And the cool thing about these titles is they automatically fade in and fade out. So the transitions are seamless and not jarring. So I'm going to go ahead and change the color again. Here's one. Okay, done. Back to our timeline. And when we play on our 360 video, see how it fades out. That's nice, and there's my friend. Finally, I wanna add a little sticker. So they've got these cool emoji stickers. I'm going to add the, the sunglasses, dude. Make them nice and big. Cool. And again, we can adjust our length. So I want it to end at the end of this clip and start a little bit earlier. And you know what? I'll put a second one in as well. So I'll go done, and I'll add one more. 
So nice and big there, done. And again, we can adjust our length by hitting set time. And we, we wanna put this guy right at the end of that clip. All right, done. All right, that is looking good. So we've just added text, we've added stickers. Also, we can add color grades. So in this section here, which is the, the little icon in the middle, you can choose lots of presets for your color grades. A um, few good options there. I like that one. So that's really cool. And finally, you can add music. So the, the second option is the music icon. They have hundreds of different tracks you can use. I found these to be pretty good. Um, a, good, a, good a few good options. Look, it's not going to be a massive library. And this editor is more for basic 360 video editing. If you want something more complex, I would suggest you do go to Adobe Premiere or Final Cut if you, want, if you are doing something professional. If you want something just quick, you want to smash out to social media, then Vue is a good way to go. So next I'll hit save and share. And now it's going to save to our camera roll, which we can then upload to Facebook or YouTube. One awesome feature Veer just added is the ability to import 360 photos into your timeline. So you can now convert your photos into a video. And here you can choose the duration of these clips. You can add text and effects just like you could with the videos, but for photo. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed this tutorial. It's been Ben from Life in 360. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below. We're on youtube.com slash life in 360 photo. Also, I'm on Instagram, instagram.com slash Ben Claremont. Finally, Facebook, facebook.com slash life in 360 photo. Until next time, keep capturing your world in 360. But this has been your boy, Ben Claremont from Little Star NYC, and we'll see you in the next video.